Hey guys, Ash and Throw here. Um, gonna fight this spider. Um, my first attempt, World Tier 6, just progressing through the story, doing some uh, side quests. Everything that I pops up, I'm doing along the way, kind of not skipping anything. Uh, I'm running Pyromancer with the bullets, um, the heal pull thing, I can't remember what it's called, and, uh, and I can't remember what the other thing's called, so kind of kind of not a good uh, good start to the video. Super new, don't have any, anything remembered in this game yet. But um, anyways, walking into here, and then uh, I thought I was going to have to fight some sort of dragon or leviathan. Turns out to be a spider. Um, so go in, not knowing what to expect. Um, just shooting stuff, trying to dodge things. Figure out some mechanics on the way, see what the spider's going to do. Just keep peppering it, keep using my abilities as they come up. Um, can't blink through that fire, apparently. Um, notice that uh, when the spider is about to jump to the wall here, um, I just kept shooting it, and then I noticed uh, it's when I noticed the weak point on its back, uh, right above its head. Uh, you can shoot the shell off it turns yellow and then uh, you can do some extra damage there so I'm about to shoot it off right here this is when I discovered it um, obviously that turns into weak point and uh, you can do a bit of extra damage there uh, now the spider being made out of lava and it's cooling that shell rehardens all the time on its own so you gotta constantly be pulling it off uh, it looks like shooting it in the mouth there you can get some crits too um, yeah and I kinda just work through the motions and try to figure out what this boss is about uh, right now it's pretty easy You're just shooting and dodging shooting and dodging nothing nothing special there just uh, they did a good job with the uh, the blue marks on the ground where not to stand so instead of not standing in the red like standard MMOs and games and stuff like that don't stand in the blue blue is bad it's not good for you um, yeah, so there was a charge mechanic, showed the line where the guy was going to charge or where the spider was going to charge. Um, going around, just dodging everything. Still getting the feeling. Pretty pretty easy fight so far in my opinion, nothing, nothing crazy happening. Um, just dodging stuff, shooting dodge. Looking for, you know, thinking, ah, oh, easy peasy mode, it's no problem. Just run around. Ooh, watches on the butt. But looks like it might take a little extra damage. And then we get a surprise little treat here. So I'm assuming that first phase bar was um, for the first phase. You get that first chunk of the health bar down. Seeing a bunch of ads coming in. So naturally I just go to uh, kill them before they can get at me. Uh, not realizing that they blow up and do a ton of damage when they lead it, leap at you. So trying to kill them. Uh, having a good time. Running around, boss is coming back out. About to lay some weapon on him again here. Um, seeing what phase two is all about. See if it's anything different. So far it's uh, rinse and repeat. Shoot, dodge, shoot, dodge. Um, try to bust a shell on its back. On its butt. Um, yeah, and that looks to be about it so far. So just trying to get it all done and push through to the next phase still still nothing crazy happening lots of lava they did a really good job with the lava in this game it actually looks like it's hot uh, the floor is wavy as you're walking across it every time the spider jumps down onto it waves come out okay so adds during this phase uh, during second phase while you're fighting the boss all right some fire spots just keep whittling them down it's actually a pretty long fight probably because I'm world tier six um, my weapons are blue my armor is blue um, I'm only running tier one um, abilities pyromancer abilities I don't have any of the tier two stuff yet so yeah so definitely takes increased damage from the uh, from the shell um, so rinse and repeat through here um, yeah all right looks like we got some butt fire happening here so we're just gonna try to stay on them and kill these ads a um, little bit more coming out uh, really wish I would have kept my flame wave but that one that one worked um, 
try to pull this guy into uh, phase three and see what phase three is all about. So again, just uh, let's dodge him up and pepper him with some more stuff. Um, uh, you know, I really, really enjoy that uh, that middle, middle ability for the extra health pull um, right when you need it. It really, really saves saves your bacon, in my opinion. It, it's just my playstyle, I guess. If you're running um, full explosion builds or something like that, um, you know, because Pyromancers, anytime the target's got any kind of burn or ash or whatever Pyromancer abilities you have, kill that target, that's how you heal. Um, but it's nice to have something that can just rip you back up to full health here, like that. Yoink. Um, you know, it's uh, it's super handy. I uh, I don't think I'll ever get rid of that ability, but super new to the game. I'm like level 12 or 13 when I'm fighting this guy on World Tier 6, and we're busting into Phase 3. Look at this, amazing. This guy, uh, this is the coolest fight I've ever been in. Um, lots of stuff, lots of mechanics to look at, lots of things to work through. Uh, seeing these flame walls, I'm just shooting this guy, and then I'm like, oh no, the flames are flame walls are chasing me. So, uh, you know, running, looking for openings while I'm running. Um, it's pretty, it's pretty awesome. Waiting for it to stop, trying to get some uh, DPS in there while he's uh, chasing me around. Uh, I found that this phase is the easiest out of the three, uh, as long as you're aware that that flame wall moves. Um, and uh, I think there's three, I think it's a, there's three separate lines or three separate wa flame wave walls. Uh, so just run between those, look for the opening, and then I just shot the body. I'm not sure if that's where you're supposed to shoot or not, but uh, it seemed to be the logical place for me. Um, you know, because he's right there, he's right in front of me. I probably should have switched to my shoddy to get some more damage, but... Um, I didn't because I was still kind of panicking trying to figure out what I was doing in this boss fight. Um, you know, ads are coming out at the same time, dodging flame walls and just, yeah, shooting the body, trying to survive. Uh, use your abilities on cooldown. Uh, pretty much, I think I stuck with the assault rifle the whole, the whole fight. I don't think I switched to my handguns or my shoddy at all. Um, yeah, and that's, uh, that's it. That's the spider boss as a pyromancer. Uh, there, I did a level 12, world tier 6, and blue weapons, blue gear. Um, from here, I just kind of run around and see if I can find any chests or anything. And uh, I didn't find anything special in here, so if you guys see anything or know that there's something in here, let me know because hopefully we can come back and fight this boss again because he's pretty awesome. Other than that, that's the uh, that's the video. Um, just wanted to give you a glimpse of what the first real boss is like that you fight in uh, Outriders and uh, gotta say if they're all gonna be like this I think this would be a great fight multiplayer uh, having a couple buddies with you because just solo it was pretty rad um, really enjoyed this game so far I know people were having issues with it but uh, I've had next to none but I I've only just started and I think they've just done a patch but anyways Thanks for watching everybody, um, keep fit, stay safe and have fun.